Welcome back, everyone. 6.09 is your time now on this Friday morning. Looking out at Interstate 2 from our Fire Bureau. A few more folks out on the roadways this morning. We're in good shape as far as the roads are concerned. Radar is quiet and visibilities are looking good. But it is another cold start. Now dropping to freezing at Hardington. Now below freezing at 31. Now at freezing Edinburgh, 32 degrees. Low to mid 30s have been the story pretty much all morning long. And we've had clouds around. That has kept us from getting down into widespread 20s across the area. But the winds are not really helping us out all that much. So north winds at about 10 to 15 miles an hour this morning is making it feel like the mid and upper 20s out there. The uh, wind chill advisory goes on until noon today for all of the Rio Grande Valley. And then we do have a freeze warning in effect until 8 a.m. because there is still a good shot that some areas will that are above freezing now will drop below freezing uh, right around sunrise, if not before, as those clouds continue to break up. Northwest winds, there you go, 10 to 15 miles per hour. They're going to start to die off today. In fact, they're going to go calm overnight tonight. So even though we're going to have another cold morning tomorrow, wind chills should not... Uh, add any uh, uh, insult to, to injury to as far as that's concerned. Low to mid 50s today, but with a lot of sunshine, those north breezes are still kind of on the chilly side. So we're still going to have a hard time warming up today. But boy, by the weekend, those winds start to shift around to the east, get a little bit more humidity around. 67 for Saturday. Look at that on Sunday into the mid 70s. Weak front moves through on Monday, drops us back down to the 60s, but I'll take that. And then we rebound nicely by Wednesday up to 80 degrees.